Cyclone Taute continues to intensify off of the coast of India. It is now a Category 3 on the Saffir Simpson Hurricane wind scale based on our estimates. The position right now is 16.6 degrees north and 72.5 degrees east. Taute currently has maximum sustained winds of 120 miles per hour and a pressure of 951 millibars. Its current movement is towards the north-northwest at 13 miles per hour and its current CDPS rating is 6. The breakdown on that CDPS rating, rating of uh, wind speeds are expected to have major impacts. Rainfall potential, major impacts can be expected from that as well. Significant storm size and the overall threat to land is major. Stage six means that devastating impacts are expected to occur. This is an extremely dangerous situation and absolutely nothing to take lightly at all. Current wind field right now, it is a uh, relatively average size tropical cyclone tropical storm force winds are brushing the uh, west coast of India as it has sustained winds of 120 miles per hour that remains offshore and here is the current distances in miles from Powys India it is 58 miles Mumbai India that is 173 miles from Surat it's 314 miles from Rajkot it is 415 miles and from Karachi Pakistan it is 675 miles, and there are also cyclone warnings in effect for the uh, locations listed below. Maximum sustained winds again are at 120 miles per hour. SATCON and the ADT are a bit above that at 125 miles per hour, and the Joint Typhoon Warning Center lags behind at about 105 miles per hour. Here is the latest forecast made by our very own K. It will continue to intensify into a strong Category 4 cyclone before making landfall as a 140 mile per hour cyclone in western India. Sea surface temperatures remain very warm on the west coast of India, over 30 degrees Celsius in many locations up until landfall. Uh, it is expected to continue to intensify. Um, H wharf rainfall totals. Uh, significant rainfall is expected on the coast of Western India uh, and penetrating far inland too, four to eight inches, possibly reaching 16 inches in some locations are expected. And the latest wind forecast, tropical storm force winds will continue to brush the coast, uh, the west coast of India today and into tomorrow. And then hurricane force winds are expected around the landfall locations. Here is the latest uh, model diagnostics. It is expected again to intensify until landfall. Uh, very strong cyclone is expected from this. Uh, deep layer shear is expected to continue to go down, which is not good news considering that sea surface temperatures are only expected to remain about the same, which is very warm, and the mid-level relative humidity will remain favorable before landfall. Uh, the track consensus is pretty good, so it is pretty much expected to go into western India. And taking a look at the latest satellite image, uh, it is a very well-organized storm with a uh, well-organized eye and an eye wall off the coast of India.